the updates on about my scooting. Like, I had a meeting with my advisor just to make sure I am on the right path. And I am. I was going to double major myself, but I was, looked at it and by the time I do one of the programs, I will be starting the other program as well. So, I had to don't add that other program and just stick with what I have. In the midst of all of this, me sticking with this one program that I am, of course, nursing. Since I have just this anatomy to do, that is it. Um, take the T's test, the book that I have shown you, use the app, keep practicing, actually schedule it out. And I think I really want to schedule it out since, I want to say November. I want to schedule it for November. That would give me time to actually make sure I understand it. Stay focused on my anatomy because some of that scientist is in the T's test. On the top of that, practice on my math. <sighs> we already know about that story, right? Mmm. Uh, mmm. Do I need to say more? I know how to do it. But it's been a while. But, like I said, since I have, with that meeting with my advisor, good things are going up. Once I pass. Oh, speaking of that, my grade point average. For some odd reason, I probably have to take another class over. So they have a boost, push me back some. Hope not. But it probably will, and I'm going to get irritated if it do, because my mindset was done with this year, get done with that part, if I actually did it right. It probably will, because if I'm actually looking at it, I probably will be done in a, actually graduate in 2026, actually. Yeah, that would be my graduating year, 2026, not 2025, because... You can't take your clinicals in the summer. You probably can. I know some people couldn't, but it's a spring and fall semester. So that probably put me back. That probably, yeah, that's so that would be okay. So I really graduated in 2026, not 2025. Okay, so that should be okay. So a year and a half. Okay. Even though I was trying to measure in 2025, but I messed myself up with that one. Okay. But listen. Continue passing this anatomy. Like, I am good. I suffered two tests that I took. Kind of kicked myself in the, in the back of the head. It's like I thought, you know how you, when you write notes, you don't want to write too much? you don't want to write too little. And some of the stuff that you don't talk about, you will never know if it's on the test or not. And that was the moment. You didn't talk about it. Well, you mentioned it about it, and then that was it. And how that little sentence was on the test. You did it one, two seconds. Oh, this is going to be, this is such, such, and this is this. Get in detail that you did the other part. But anyway, it's a passing grade, but it was not where my standards were. It was a C, not an A, like my last three. So, yeah, I'm okay with it, but I'm pushing myself hard enough for I can actually pass. This class is ending December. I have two months, October and November. To make sure I get good, 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 good grades. Like, good grades. Like, quiz no, know when I'm coming. And this is when I get irritated. 
my forehead gets the itching. Like, come on. Okay, well, listen. I'm a proud of myself. But so far, everything is good. I can actually graduate. Once I pass this class, take the T's test. I got to schedule that. And I got to pay for it. I'm going to take it in my own comfort home. Only reason if I, okay, taking the T's test for the school that I go to, you can do two choices. You can do it at the campus. I think that's like $65. And if you take it at home, that's $110. So I'm going to pay that 110 Even though I didn't want to, but I'm going to pay that 110 Only reason why I'm paying that 110 is because I can stay in my own home. And right about now, I'm hearing too many stories or too, getting too much um, alerts about the school I go to, what's going on down there. So I'm going to stay in my safe environment, peaceful house by taking that test. That's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to pay for that 110 and I'm going to schedule it out and make sure I have it. Write it down when I need to take it. I'm going to study it as far as possible. Like I said, read the books, use the app, and use any other stuff that I need to in the midst of this. Because your girl want this. You know how you can taste it or you can touch it or you can almost poke it? That's where I'm at in life. That I can actually feel it, what I'm doing. So I'm proud of myself that I did that. But my advisor, I like if I pass I pass this class and take the T's test, I can Yeah. And then schedule that once I get my results. But I kinda I tell her I meet with her once a month on a reason because I don't want to be a pest or be irritated by her. I don't want her to be irritated like her again like that. So I kind of like pop in here and there like that. So make sure we still on that straight line. No rudy coasters on that straight line. My life is about to expire. And I told myself this is supposed to be it. But I guess God said, you got one more year of this. Then it's it. So I have to do what he say. Or listen to what he say. Because uh, we're getting close. Again. I'll talk to y'all later. I'm going to take years off. Bye-bye.